Okay, what's your name? Uh, Daniel. Daniel. Okay. Rowan. Owen. Where are you guys from? Uh, Mexico. Mexico. Netherlands. Netherlands. How did you guys meet? Uh, we go to school together here. Yeah. School? Yeah. Oh, you guys students? Yeah. Yeah. What, what kind of...? Uh, we are le uh, learning Japanese, actually. <laughs> learning Japanese? Yeah. You guys don't work in Japan, right? No, not yet. Okay, so... I'm waiting to get my contract in Japan, actually. <laughs> now? No, yeah. you are, yeah. Now you're applying the job? Uh, it's already kind of finalized, but uh, still need to sign the contract to, to actually work here. Oh, yeah. so... Y but y uh, the main purpose here for me is to learn Japanese. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we are still beginners, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, so how long have you been in Japan so far? <laughs> Two and a half weeks. <laughs> Two and a half? Yeah. Oh. And you? A month. One month? Yeah, one month. One month, just one month. Okay, yeah. okay. Waiting for the corona <laughs> to end and for Japan to all open their borders for over a year. Uh, so. <laughs> yeah. My question is, what brought you to Japan? Uh, I'm an artist, so I was really into the anime stuff and pretty much what ja Japan does with animation and all this stuff. So I decided to come and learn Japanese to study more of this here. Nice. So you want to get a job in Japan like art as an artist? Yeah, I would try to. So especially what kind of job like in artist? Like a drawing pic pictures or...? Uh, character design and environment design, pretty much all of that stuff. I think when I was 14 or something, I had this obsession with Japanese games and I was really into J-pop at that time. Oh. <laughs> um, and this yeah, gave me some kind of addiction, so to say, to, the, okay. to Japan and I really wanted to learn Japanese and now I'm finally here. Okay. So hopefully, I hope someday that I can work for a Japanese game company. But okay, what kind of game did you like? Uh, JRPGs, like Final Fantasy, I think ah, this is the most... RPG. Ah, yeah. okay, I got you. Like, yeah. that, uh, like that, 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 those kind of games, single-player games, I played them so much and mm -hmm. uh, really love them. Hopefully someday I can work on one of those as well. It's a simple question, but what's it like living in Japan so far? So far it's been good. Yeah, I, I really like the food here. <laughs> food? Yeah. Uh, for example? Uh, I liked ramen a lot. Ramen? And yakisoba, I like it too. too. Oh, you like noodles, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, for me, yeah, it's great. Everything is clean. People are polite. Love it. Yeah. For me, I like the tonkatsu <laughs> a lot. <laughs> I ate it way too much. And yeah, sushi, of course. And, uh, okay. So all, all the fish dishes, I love it. <laughs> so do you have Japanese friends? Uh, no. No? I had. Have it seems a bit complicated now. I'm in Japan, unfortunately, but complicated. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, do do you feel like difficulty in, in making Japanese friends? Uh, well, I haven't tried it yet because I don't know much Japanese yet. <laughs> ah, yeah, just for a month, right? Yeah, yeah. But I've heard it's pretty difficult to do so. But for me, it's really difficult. Difficult. I tried, but uh, unfortunately, it's yeah. Especially when, since I'm here, I feel it's quite difficult to communicate well. Even though my typing, I can type quite okay in Japanese, but uh, as long as the simple stuff. But uh, yeah. Oh, so, so do you usually use like a translating apps to communicate with uh, Japanese people, right? When I talk, at least when I type, uh, for example, online or something, I think 80% I do without translator. And yeah, you know, it's just a specific kanji or something that I really don't know what <laughs> what's, uh, it, what's yeah. it about, and I have to translate it, unfortunately. So, how do you try to make friends in Japan? Uh, up till now, just try to find people online. Online? Oh, <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. The country was closed, and now we're here. It's everything. Yeah, there's so much going on in the first few weeks that we're here that I have no idea where to look. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> what kind of service do you do you use? when it comes to making friends online? Uh, yeah, I used this language sharing app before. Uh-huh. Uh, like a people, people I to I talk you or a hello, hello talk? Hello or? talk I used before, yeah. Um, and not that many people are interested in learning Dutch, unfortunately. Mm. <laughs> and for English, they tend to go more to the American people or people from the UK or something. But, ah. uh, yeah, this is one way I tried. But, uh, if you have any suggestions, I'm open. <laughs> okay, so what are you gonna do for making a friends in Japan? Uh, 
Of course, the first step is just learning the language and, <laughs> and try to talk to people. Mm -hmm. Let's see how that goes. But the last question, do you recommend to live in Japan? So far, I think I do. I do recommend it. Just because everything is so clean and it works pretty well, I think, yeah, I would recommend it. So you, you are now you are enjoying the life in Japan, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I would recommend it, but I think it's really for a specific kind of people. Oh. That's uh, to live here or not, because yeah, Japanese people, they are quite strict with everything. And you have to be open to... Uh, follow those those rules and I'm not sure if everyone can do that oh. or for vacation that's a recommendation for everybody of 100% what kind of people do you recommend I guess really the people who are into uh, yeah like what you are into the anime uh, really the obsessed games, with anime and, and so uh, Japanese stuff. So, but that uh, the people are also willing to yeah to accept the other parts of the culture that they might not like as much. Okay. So.